this. Beginning at midnight, for the next 24 hours, you have the body of the opposite gender. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do differently for that day? Thank goodness you didn't kill yourself with Michael. Oh, wow. Okay, well, I think we've all, in one way or another, considered the prospect of being a member of the opposite sex at one point. Hopefully I'm not the only one, because that would make me feel extremely weird. <laughs> but if I woke up and was rejuvenated as a woman, I think that what I would do differently first and foremost would probably be look at myself in the mirror more than normal. I mean, I'm not used to these certain body parts and the physique of the female body. I would hope that I would be beautiful, but what is beauty? It's in the eye of beauty. Really. So my first day as a woman, uh, I think that I would almost run it like a social experiment. I would go out on the town, do some grocery shopping, normal errands, and just see if my life is, feels any different. Feel if I'm treated differently or maybe looked at by the construction workers on the side of the road giving me a little... <laughs> you know, <laughs> flattered, but at the same time, you respect me because I'm a woman. I think that I'd be a great woman for a day. I would represent. I don't think I would do anything that would be too ridiculous. I don't think I would cross any boundaries or anything like that. But I would certainly like to see what it felt like to be completely out of my comfort zone. Perhaps I would try to do something... I, don't, I, I truly don't know. I, I truly don't know what I would do Just as, say as, a, as a woman. <laughs> I, this is something that I've truly never thought into great detail, but I, I would try to have the best day possible. Maybe, see, <laughs> I'm just going to quit while I'm ahead. It would be a great day. Yeah, let's do it!